Hey, hey, how you guys doing tonight? Marriage is very important in my family. My parents just want me to get married, yeah. And, and, and it's funny, my mom would give me advice about women. It wasn't the most positive. Yeah, this is my favorite advice my little Italian mother ever gave me about the women. They say, Frank, watch out, huh? <laughs> Keep you high open. The women of today, it's not like when I was young. No, no, no. The women of today, it's different. The women of today, it's like olive oil. I'm like, olive oil? What the? Yeah, like olive oil. They say they're virgin. <laughs> Some of my friends are still single. Um, I think I know what's happening. Uh, people are asking the wrong questions, on the, especially with this computerized dating, online dating. People are asking the wrong questions, you know, like, what's your favorite color? Blue? Oh, mine's purple. Oh, my God, that's pretty close. What's your favorite food? Chinese? Me too. Oh, my God, we should get married. <laughs> yeah. I, yeah this, but, you know, I, I mean, I'm married now. I know what it takes to keep uh, a marriage going, a relationship going. I mean, if I was single again, <laughs> these would be the questions I'd be asking. <laughs> Uh, yeah, oh, yeah, hi. Uh, so, um, <clears throat> what temperature do you like the thermostat at? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Do you sleep on your side of the bed or do you sleep on an angle and jam your toes up my ass? Yeah. 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 Are you always right? <laughs> yes. <laughs> you know what question I forgot to ask my wife? If she likes sports. My wife hates sports. I can watch hours of her entertainment this, Canadian next top that, American that, this. I can watch extra, extra that. I can watch hours of these shows, and the minute I turn it, I come, I work the weekends. I just want to watch one hockey game on a Tuesday. No, the minute I turn that TV on, there she is in my ear. Oh, here we go. Three hours of my life down the tubes. Hey, I got to watch this crap. These men smashing up against each other. It's all about violence for you men. Yes, it's all about violence. That's why there's violence in the world. Do you know that? That's why, because you men rule the world. That's right. That's, yeah, and that's why there's wars, because you men rule the world. You know, if women rule the world, there'd be no wars. Do you know that? If women rule the world, there'd be no wars. No, absolutely. If women rule the world, there'd be no wars. No, just a bunch of jealous countries not talking to each other. Yeah. It's true. <laughs> so. But uh, I feel bad for you women, though. Uh, you know, you guys are prisoners. You women are prisoners to your hormones. You know, when you're pregnant, um, you know, every month, it's it's like like most of the time, it's not even you. Um, it's, yeah, it's I mean, yeah, it just takes you over. It's just like mm, you can't become this. It's a lot of fun. Uh, but, no, actually, I was at a family get-together where all the women were sitting at a table, and they were all talking about the first time. They got this women thing that happens, you know, every month that turns perfectly normal women into the devil. You know that thing. Yeah. And one of them talked about how they told their mom. It was incredible. It's like, Mom, by the way, I got my period. And the mother was like, oh, our little girl's a woman. Let's get the champagne. And that's beautiful. Celebratory thing. That's the way it should be. Yeah, it's not really the same when us guys realize that we've become a man. <laughs> kind of a more embarrassing situation, eh, guys? <laughs> How do we tell our fathers that one, you know? Hey, Dad, <laughs> by the way, <sighs> you know, I was in the shower, you know, cleaning myself, you know, and then I started lathering myself, and then I really started lathering, you know, Dad, I want to make sure I got everything. I'm lathering, I'm lathering. All of a sudden, I don't know what happened. I felt this thing. It was like, <laughs> I got my period. Yeah. I don't know if I can wait another month for this to happen again. This... <laughs> you guys have been great. Thank you very much. Good night, everybody.